Hey, welcome back. Do you ever worry about home security? Well, you know, really keeping the safety and well-being of your family? I kind of tend to think of this stuff a lot just because, well, I'm kind of paranoid. I mean, I think it's in human nature that you just, well, when you have a family, you want to keep them safe. You want to do everything you can to keep them safe. I mean, sometimes it can be overwhelming and you don't know in which direction to turn. You don't know if you should think about personal safety with firearms and stuff like that or have that baseball bat next to your bed. And sometimes, well, it comes down to the simple fact of just having some good locks on your doors and making sure they're actually locked. And really, well, that's what we're going to investigate this product. Well, I say investigate, but we're going to install this product and my first initial reactions of it and how it might hold up. I'm not going to do any hardcore tests because, well, I paid money for this and I'm not going to destroy it. I mean, it's a pretty simple, straightforward operation. You know what I mean? And all you have to really do for a normal installation is go ahead and put the door latch inside the door, in between the door and the frame itself to make sure there's enough room, just in case you have to notch it out a little bit, just to recess that door latch in there. And once you have it in the proper location, you want to go ahead and mark it with a pencil. Then open your door and take that little tiny screw and just screw it inside you know, the adjusting plate. Once you have that in there and you adjust everything, you close the door, dry fit it, make sure that that door latch is going to sit just where you want it, then you can go ahead and drill the three inch long screws through the door frame into the stud. It's optional, but you could take that little screw back out and then throw another three inch long screw in there to get just another screw going through the door frame into the stud. Well, for a real quick installation, that worked out pretty well. And for the most normal installation, it's going to be just that easy. But for my particular installation, the latch is a little bit too far away from the door, so I'm going to go ahead and notch the door frame out just a little bit to get that latch kind of recessed inside there so that it really comes just, just close enough to make contact with the door when the door is closed. So there's no wiggle room at all. Now, if somebody really wants to get into your house, well, they're going to do it. But you know what, those first few seconds where they're trying to get in might deter them enough and it might give you enough time to, well, wake up, call 911, get that baseball bat that's beside your bed or, well, get the firearm or whatever else you might have to protect you and your family. And if it gives you that little peace of mind, well, there's no harm in that. That's all the benefit for you. And like I said, every second counts. And there's another thing you can do. You can go ahead and buy a box of those three inch long screws and well, replace all the screws inside your hinges. So you got the three inch long screws going through your hinge, through your door frame, right into the studs on all the hinges and on all the strike plates and the plates for your deadbolts as well. Just making everything that much more secure and that much stronger. Time will tell how this latch is gonna hold up, but you know what? It's gonna give me a little bit of uh, peace of mind for my family's safety. So if you do feel like you want this latch, be my guest, go ahead, check the link in the description, click on my Amazon affiliate link. It's going to help me out at no extra cost to you. It's going to help this channel out and it will help me provide content like this. Now, full disclosure, I bought this latch with my own money. I'm testing it out with, well, my own, there's no bias. I'm not biased by the, if this product sucks, I'm going to tell you. If it does fail later on, I'm going to give you an update and I'm going to let you know. But First impressions right off the bat, this product feels pretty secure, it feels pretty hefty. It is aluminum, as far as I know, but just the same, it's pretty thick and it feels like it's going to hold up. It's a lot better than those, you know, $2 ones that you buy that you throw on the door that probably bust right away anyways. So on that note, I think we're pretty much done for today, and I'll see you on the next one. Was that a little too hokey, a little too goofy, you know, I'll see you on the next one. It wasn't that bad, right? I mean, you, you tell me. I like ending it that way, but sometimes when you repeat the same thing over and over, it's just, it, it sounds forced, but it's not. Because honestly, I'll see you on the next one. That sounded better. And there's another thing you can do as well. Those three inch long screws, go ahead and buy a bunch of them. Use them on, uh, and there's a, I'm,